Morgan and Tyler Walker, parents of two, say they understand the importance of teaching their children how to swim. It can happen to anybody at any time. Not too long before they met, Morgan suffered a tragic loss. Her one-year-old daughter, Caden Riley, drowned inside their family pool. The back door of the house was actually left open and um, I was just getting ready for work and it happened very, very quickly. An accident she now believes could have been prevented. A few months before my daughter passed away, I had heard a story on a news similar to mine and I just thought, man, how negligent or how irresponsible and a few months later, I was the one on the news. Thanks to ISR or Infant Swimming Resource, kids can learn how to rescue themselves by knowing what to do when they're in water. It has given me peace of mind and a comfort that you can't put a price on. The couple's two children, four-year-old River and two-year-old Willow, are in their fourth week at ISR under Brittany Briones. <laughs> the only ISR instructor in the coastal bend. Most drownings happen when they are not supposed to be in a body of water, when they're not supposed to be out swimming. They find their way out. Data shows 86% of all children who drown are fully clothed. In the eight-week course, children receive 60 hours of hands-on in-water training. Some start as young as six months old. How to self-rescue, so they problem solve also. They would learn to swim, float, swim. The younger ones, six months and younger, they learn if they fall in to roll over and float. That's why it's so important to Morgan and Tyler to make sure their children and others know what to do to stay alive. Whether or not, you know, you have a pool at your home, your, your child's going to be around water at some point, wherever they are. Michelle Pedraza, Three news. Yeah. High five.